Okay, we are on day 46. Netzach Shebemalchus. Each time that I choose the high road, I draw the kingdom of heaven, the third temple, into the below, giving reality to the eternal as I watch the transitory fade away. Ah, oh, can you imagine each brick of the Beit HaMikdash etched in stone your endurance of being on this planet Earth? Can you imagine the stamp of your hard work of really enduring that challenging situation? That's what's happening. We're making eternal our efforts forever. Each brick, each brick being built. Each day getting closer to that final holy kingdom being drawn down on this face of this earth. I mean, Mashiach now already. <sighs> Can't you wait to see your signature on each stone that you have accomplished on this journey called life? Get in the habit of like seeing that moment like forever. Just get in the habit like of seeing that it's really documented and it's forever going to be yours. Who needs a wing in Manhattan or Florida? <laughs> you know, we have the space of the Beta Migdash that is ours forever. The sphere of the day is what within me resists, denies, diminishes, or deludes me regarding Hashem's constant, infinite love that fills the world. There is only the infinite light of Hashem. The resistance I feel is because of attachment to the world of illusion without the balance of knowing deeply that all there is in the world is Hashem. What is coming up that resists this it feels powerful, fiery, movement full of force and pain, of heaviness and darkness. It is Kedusha, given to the illusion, in order that I have the opportunity to recognize my Creator, the only power. I love Hashem. I empty all my thoughts, feelings, urges, impulses, emotions, and beliefs into the infinite light and submit my heart and mind to Hashem's perspective that I am bitter in His light so that Hashem may utilize my mind and heart as a channel through which the Kedusha from the world of illusion may return to the infinite light and be revealed in the world. I want my heart and mind to be a channel to reveal you, Hashem. Please accept my tshuva for attaching to the illusion and please instead strengthen me in attachment only to you, Hashem Echad. Please help me be a strong vessel of Amuna and a channel for your love and mercy to come into this world.